good morning welcome back to my channel it's your girl a siri thank you all for tuning back in today it's been a long long time anyways guys um i believe you've seen what i showed uh, from the beginning of this video yeah we're doing some unboxing of my african food today so actually uh my husband came in he traveled to nigeria before so he just came in like this morning and i worked last night so i was very tired when he even came in so i just and i needed to like open the bag to get um some to just um a lot air to enter some of the stops you know they've been packed inside the bag i don't know if there's anything that is going to get spoiled so I just decided to like make that little video so you guys can just see how the thing came. You know these men, you have to beg them, like you have to beg them to carry stuff for you. <laughs> I'm just imagining myself that if I'm the one that went to Nigeria, the kind of things I would carry, like this man did not even carry up to his kilo and was already complaining about the load. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> half bread is better than none, right? So what I showed at the beginning everything he brought so i've opened it and my whole floor is just a bit of a mess there are not much though just few items but i will just start showing you one after the other okay so yeah i have some golden more this is for my son like tux he loves golden more a lot it's very very expensive when you're buying it here from those that are selling so any opportunity I have to get it, I just get some. So I got um, about four of this pack. Yeah. And also, I got some fresh vanilla. <laughs> My friend Vanilla. I'm going to make some nice banga soup. There's nothing like fresh banga, not that kind of food. Yeah, I have this. Um, in fact, I'm not preparing it like this. How let me show you guys in a different way. Stay tuned. By the way, if you haven't subscribed to this channel, do where to click on that subscribe button, like, share, and subscribe. Yes, share. Okay, <laughs> let me show you guys in details how this thing looks like. So, uh, I already showed you guys the golden more so I got four of this and yes I have my banga my fresh banga here yeah that I also got and here I have this fish <laughs> this fish in my place we call it pommy you can see this fish you are seeing here it's very expensive this whole fish is Eighteen thousand naira. Like this whole fish you are seeing here is very expensive. We use it um, from the delta part of Nigeria, and if you are Nurobo, you relate well. And um, if we are having any uh, ceremony like marriage or burial, and we have to cook our native soup, which is ovo soup, we normally use this fish to cook it it's very very nice and why i like it then eh? hmm. if you just break small part and put in your mouth to just fill up your mouth like it's used to rice hmm. very very nice use the head <laughs> very sweet and nice so yeah so i got this here yeah, I have some. I don't want this unboxing to be too long. I'm not worry. I got some stock fish. I leave it when I want to make a goose soup. So I don't really get a lot of this. Then this is um, <laughs> this is bonga. I already removed the share. I like using this for my concussion rice, my palm oil rice. I love using this a lot. Then this one we call it tipo <laughs> in my place. It's dry meat. This small thing you are seeing here, 
once you put it in hot water it will rise like this nothing when you are showing it it will fill your mouth it looks small but when you put hot water it will rise you guys will see when i'll be using it it's very nice very very tasty so i got some of these ones we have here some crayfish i told my mom to grind some so these are the grinded ones and these are the ones she didn't grind i love it when my mom prepares this stuff for me because she takes her time to select all the dirt out so when i want to use it i just pack no need to select like it's so so nice and so easy that way many of you know this this is um big crayfish i love it hey! oh, 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 oh. ah see the way i almost messed up this thing so this is big crayfish i'm going to put it in another bag we have two different types so this is one type this one is actually very cheap not too too cheap but it's easy to find my mom already took out the so that to take out the sharp part for me she already removed them so no stress anymore and there's this other one inside this one is actually very very sweet but it's very expensive and like my mom said she could i wanted just this but she couldn't find it like it was really scarce then she already bought this other one then she saw a lady that had it so she just bought some you can see this one is flat this is more expensive than this and it's very nice very very nice i think my mom said the basket of this they were saying uh, more than ten thousand or so a basket of this one it's very expensive whereas the other one this other one is uh, four thousand or so for basket so to get some curry and thyme yeah so i got a roll of korean thyme i love nigeria korean thyme i also got some uh, maggi this is the chicken no and this is the the beef bone i think or just the regular one and this is normal maggi and this the love rice spice and this two spice whichever one <laughs> is very popular in nigeria so i got like two rows of this each as uh, about 10 yeah 10 i just got two of this some beans we used to have uh, fine beans here but you know nigerian beans is i feel it different in taste and everything so the one i buy here i usually use it for more and more why this the one i get from nigeria i prefer to cook this one like if i want to cook normal beans i prefer to use nigeria beans so here i have some beans see here i have some beans these ones are big big seeds of beans <laughs> They call it iron beans, this one. And also I used to like this bit. Like, so I had two bags of this like this. Two of this. I got my mom back. Then here guys is my baby soup spice. <laughs> I've missed my local pepper soup spice. The one I bought here from someone. It's already grinded, mixed with different things, but I'm not getting that filling of the pepper soup so i got some this is cameroon pepper this is very very hot very hot i can't play with it then here is some grinded pepper very very hot you know your girl loves pepper here is um, native salt for my wosu Okay, here's native sauce. Yeah, I love this. 
this is my they call it this one african nutmeg i think yes for my pepper soup then this is the long one uh, this one yeah we use it for our pepper soup as well use this together with the, um, the potash to make my native soup this is what we call belle tete belle tete we use it for banga soup And this is what we call Itaiko, my place. Yeah. This also, we add this to use it to make banga soup. I also add it to make uh, my pepper soup. This one. I put my mom to get more. This won't be enough. For. <laughs> and which one is this one? Okay, this one is called in my tribe, we call it Irogoje in my language. It's like this other one that I showed. But this one is very flat. We use this for banga soup. I don't add this to pepper soup, just for banga soup. And you use just little, not much. So that's why she packs it. You can just use just five or six of the small seeds. Uh, what do I have here? My mom said she bought this thing like, I don't know. She said you have to use it like very little when you are cooking. You can see just this small one. She said she didn't buy much because I've never seen her using it and she don't want me to start putting a lot in my food. I just need little. That when you make that our native soup, it makes it not to turn watery. Uh, I think this is also one of these should be bitter leaf and one of these should be the belletete for the banga soup. I think so. No need to open this, but here is a grinded melon. This is my grinded melon here. So I have two of this. We eat egusi soup a lot. So I told her to get a lot of this one. So we got about two of this. Gary. We don't make gari, so I said I told her not to get a lot. I only need it for drinking. So this is my gari here. I like gari from my place. It's very clean and very tasty. <laughs> this granite I cannot do without. Like it's not possible. I told my mom to my mom. I asked my mom, is it the season? She said, Yeah, that she'll go and look for it. This granite, I told my mom to add it for me. You won't believe it. This one is already like they don't fry it. There's a way they do it. They we call it wear granite in my side. There's a way they do it. They make this granite by using um is this sun or something. That was what they use. Like it's very, very nice. Let me show you how it looks inside. Very nice. You eat it and you won't get tired. It has very nice taste. In fact, when my husband came this morning, I was very tired though. I opened it and I started eating. Tell you how much I've missed this. So, these are everything. I also got some relaxer, about six parts of this mega growth and one kinky um, twist. I two packs of it. So I want to make my hair. So yeah, these are everything. When you send man, when you tell man to make carry load, they know the Greek carry all these men. <laughs> what to do, guys? But have bread, like I said, is better than none. These are everything we got, and I'm so ready to make some nice stuff, especially with this banga. Can't wait to make banga soup. Anyone that sees this granos will laugh at me like carrying granos from Nigeria. <laughs> I so much love this granos. So, anyways, thank you all for tuning in today. Please don't forget to like, like I said, subscribe if you haven't, and give this video a thumbs up and also share this video. Till next time, bye.